Before diving deep into learning configuration objects, we should discuss a few important things. The first one is the forms and basic principles of working with them. Here is how a form looks like in the user mode. It is document sales form. Forms allow users to interact with databases. Here they can enter, modify and manage database data using options offered by the forms. Now let us switch to designer and check the window to create forms for document sales. Here we see two areas. Form selection area, where we can create several forms of the same type, for example a document form. The platform treats the selected form as the default one. With no form selected, the platform generates and uses one automatically. A list of all manual created forms. Let us consider types of forms in more detail. Naturally, we start with the document form itself. Then comes a list form for all created documents. And a choice form that the platform opens when we need to select our documents. In the example below, you can see the choice form in document sales for catalog products. To create a form for document sales, click the button and select document form. You can keep the name as is. Click next to list all standard and manually created attributes that we can add into the form. Click finish and ta-da, <laughs> we get to the form editor.